Okay, well, um, this will be a really brief video, but I've just got hold of um, some special sockets which are remote controlled via the Raspberry Pi. The Raspberry Pi is actually next door, um, but anyway, this is in my bedroom. There's one of these sockets. They they go into the the mains, and then you put another device after them, just like the ones in my house, and um, that I had already. But the ones I had already were remote controlled with a little um, regular remote control. But this is actually a bit more advanced because you can control it from the computer. So the Raspberry Pi is next door. I'm on the same network with this laptop, so I've then connected over Wi-Fi to the Raspberry Pi, and that's what's running here. Um, I can just then run this program, uh, which is um, got a whole load of information about how this works. But basically, it has um, a cycle that it will demonstrate. Uh, the different options of turning one off and one on. The first socket is actually next door, so that's going to go on and then going to go off. Uh, you won't notice anything there. But the second one is the one I just showed in the video just earlier, and that's in a moment we should see that the, the room gets a bit brighter because the bedside lamp here is going to go on. There, you can see that's on and then off. So press that, and then it's going to go on again because all of them go on, and then it's going to go off again. There. So you can cycle through, and it's kind of fun. And that's the light there. Uh, so keep going. That's it going on and off. So it's really that simple. Um, it's pretty good value. It's 20 quid. Um, you need to have a Raspberry Pi already, of course, but um, they're not expensive either. And uh, anyway, I shall be trying to figure out how to make this even cooler by sticking some sort of web front end on it so I can use my phone to... Uh, and turn it on and off, and then I might even try and extend that again to to um, uh, to figure out when I get home. It'll send up, send off a ping of some sort to let the system know I'm back, and then turn the lights on and off. 